Hey guys, welcome back to the Wandering Wind. Um, I'm going to be starting on the next part of um, the Argon quest, starting with meeting Zhang Li for a meal. So we're still going over Farewell Archaic Ward. This will be the third part that we've done on this particular quest. So hopefully after this part we will actually be done. No Maybe. I've already done so. Excellent. Third round knockout is not for lightweights like those taverns in Mondstadt. Here, the owner does not take such unorthodox orders as fruit juice. Hmm. So does this mean I can order wine this time? I ordered some wine fermented sweet <laughs> for you. I could have if it expected is to that. Your liking, dear customers, I shall continue the Ah, oh, actually, you know what? I'm actually going to tack this on as a part point one or whatever, just to finish this quest out, probably. As you all know, high above the land of Lear lies a pavilion in the clouds. A palace in the mist. What does it mean to have all seeing eyes? This, my friend. Lady Ningguang's masterwork that bridges, bridges earth, earth and sky. sky. Interesting. Imagine the weather is clear. And you gaze down from the deck from the world deck below. The world below. <laughs> Behold the glorious sights of Liyue Harbor, stretching out far and wide. Far and wide. Nice. They say that when Lady Ningguang there's important affairs. She retreats to her jade chamber with none but her three closest <laughs> confidants in tow. Then, why brings she these trusted <laughs> three to sift through sources, <laughs> dig through documents, looking for information? For information. Sir, <laughs> piece by piece, facts and figures paint a picture on the walls of the chamber. Mm, but where's the Ningguang's <laughs> mind is made up. It is? Having made her call, she has every last document shredded. And whoosh, ah. she scatters the shavings out her window. And the paper snow. Ah, look at them. How they billow in the wind like a sudden swirling blizzard. Mm. As the fragments fall, traces of text flicker before the eyes of the merchants of Liyue, mm. like ink stains <laughs> in white snow. The saying goes, the rarest treasures in the land <laughs> are the words brought by the paper snow. Yeah. For the words of the Tianquan have the power to move mountains, mm. all throughout the land know it. Well, you know, the rulers of the land tend to uh, make a whole lot of... Uh, but scraps Noise. of paper, and yet they guide Lady Ningguang's hand. Such is their value. Mm. Interesting. Maybe Interesting. Grasping one or two of them will surely gift you a fragment of her wisdom. Enough, Enough to say a step or two ahead, ahead of your peers. Ahead of your peers. Nice. Again, train Ningguang. Feels like we're hearing this name a lot. Yep. Patui hater. Her. She's most likely the one who hid the exuvia, and we saw her at the rite of suspension. Oh yeah, we did, we did, didn't we? Wonders, what sort of I'm gonna. But lost on his boundary. Use this as a foot. Who returned from Julian Karst? Foot. Hello. There we go. Come on, we gotta go. Wait, I am not with the Millerith, nor am I here to claim your bounty. Ah. However, I am an emissary of the Leo Chieftain. My name is Ganyu, secretary at the Yua High Pavilion, and I have come specifically to meet you. Emissary, nice. In concrete terms, I am the corporate secretary for your chieftain. At the moment, I am serving as Lady Ningguang's special emissary. Ningguang sent you? Mm -hmm. You're literally just talking about her. Come on. My apologies, you who have 
return from jail you incarse. I am duty-bound and cannot extend my courtesy to you in full. But I have with me a letter from Lady Mingguan. She extends a formal invitation to you in her capacity as Tianquan. Mm, she invites you to her palace in the sky. Ah. Official invitation? Oh, nice. Lady Mingguan said this. Invite her to come here. I wish to meet her. At mm. the Jade Chamber, together we shall snip every one of these entwining dark threads. Right. Entwining dark threads. Hmm? Well, there you have it. Yeah, the emissary who called herself Danyu just disappeared. But we've received an invitation from the Leo at Qixing. Paimon still can't believe it. Nice. We'll be meeting people that have way more <laughs> money than Paimon could ever count. <laughs> on our best manner. Paimon's up to something again, of course. <laughs> an invitation to visit the Jade Chamber is a rare honor indeed. Yes, indeed. Let's be on your way now. But don't forget about the rite of parting. Once you've finished at the Jade Chamber, meet me at Dihua Marsh. Dihua Marsh. We won't forget. Dihua Marsh. We'll see you there. <laughs> Alrighty, so. Chapter 1, Act 3. A new star approaches. It is going to begin in the next part of our continuing series. Uh, here on Let's Play Genshin Impact. I'll see you again soon. Have a wonderful day, guys. God bless.